Haley's on my podcast. Cheers. Cheers. I think it looks cute. We're gonna go take them to the wildlife rescue. Big mom is coming with me. Happy Monday. Welcome to the weekly vlog, you guys. Another day, another dollar. <gasps> I have a flight to Sydney to go to this afternoon, so we really don't have any time to waste. First mission of the day is a workout. And it's a workout from last week that I did not do. I forgot to say, if you haven't subscribed to the channel, please subscribe. Also, check out my Instagram, my TikTok, my podcast. It's called Your Safe Space. And if you are already on every channel, thank you. You're an OG. I love you. My hair's feeling soft. I did a hair treatment last night, and so we'll wash it as well when we get back. Does the workout count if you don't wear the Apple Watch? Yes, it does. I'm just being <laughs> an idiot. <sighs> All right. was actually quite good considering that I was trying to superset and get through it but I ordered this for Mr. Franklin so we can practice his exercises on here it's like a balance beam and that's going to strengthen his body as well which I'm so excited I got it from Amazon and I have linked it in my storefront in the pet section breakfast is ready I know I said last week that I shouldn't have taken a big suitcase, but I actually need to take it today because I'm taking some things with me that I need to take to the Sydney office. So I need the luggage weight on the way there, not on the way back, but whatever. We're just going to roll with it. Dried off the hair in my onesie. <laughs> the reason I'm flying to Sydney this afternoon is tomorrow I have to be in the podcast studio at like 8 a.m. And I didn't want to run the risk of having a delayed flight because I've got two guests coming on, which I'm super excited about. So I thought I'll fly in earlier on the Monday afternoon. And then my psychologist had an appointment come up today at 5.30 p.m. So I'm going to see my psych in person for the first time since I moved back to Melbourne, which I moved back to Melbourne in 2021. So I haven't seen her in two years and I'm so excited. And that's why I'm going earlier. So I didn't really have to go today because I could have done the 5.30 appointment on telehealth, but it just makes sense. I'm wasting a lot of time there, so let's pack the bag. I've been doing a tiny bit of work. We have to get in the car and head off now because I don't want to miss my flight. He wouldn't say goodbye to me. <laughs> Are you mad at mommy? I'm sorry, I'll be back tomorrow night. I love you. He's seen the suitcase. He's like, oh, you're the worst. I'm so sorry. Oh, no, it doesn't care about me. Interested in mum in the fridge, of course. <laughs> <laughs> Parked again, instead of getting an Uber. I have quite a bit of work to do. <laughs> I have to get the vlog up, guys, and it's currently 1 p.m. Airport anxiety is getting a run for its money <laughs> by the fact that I have to come here every bloody week. Anyway, it's okay. good. I'm excited and we're getting it done. I'm gonna do the vlog right now. I also went to Mecca because I am going to see my friend Steph again tomorrow. She's actually still in hospital and I just wanted to cheer her up because she had mentioned that she hadn't been able to collect her beauty loot box and the girl at Mecca here in Melbourne airport, her name is Taylor, gave me her beauty loot box. We obviously got Steph's permission. Just love Mecca. Like they're always amazing, but their customer service is honestly out of this world. And I'll give this to Steph tomorrow, which makes me happy. But we have quite a bit of work to do, so I need to stop talking shit. Okay, so my flight's delayed, which is fine. It gives me time to do more work here. I was gonna go back and get some food, but I don't feel like anything from Melbourne Airport, so I'm just gonna wait. I'm not gonna be late for my therapy, and I can get food after that. I'm scared for this flight, because apparently the weather's really bad flying into Sydney. I hope we don't have turbulence. Good afternoon, everyone. My name... 
have landed. It hasn't been good. I'll give you an update. The time check for everybody playing along is 6.15 and what time is my appointment? 5.30. We landed at 5.30. Literally on the tarmac at 5.30. I quickly called my psychologist. I honestly should have just called her right before we took off because they kept saying to us, you'll land in Sydney at 4.30 p.m. You'll land in Sydney at 4.30 p.m. I thought I'd still have an hour to get there, which was plenty of time. The weather was insane. So the flight, <laughs> the poor pilot trying to take off and trying to land, it was so windy and we were circling in the air for ages. I Usually it's an hour flight. We were on the plane for maybe like an hour 20, an hour and a half. Anyway, I've just checked in. I'm staying right near the airport. Let me give you a quick little tour. It's like a little service department and it's got a kitchenette. I'm not really gonna be doing anything. I'm definitely getting Uber Eats. Full length mirror. Hello, hello. I need to tell you the story of what happened when I checked in as well. <laughs> Double bed, I nearly fell over. Nice kind of lighting in here. Let's, oh, let's have a look. My view is suburbia luggage let's see oh my god where's the lights in here all right not bad not bad anyway i check in well i go to check in and the man requests my id where's my id it's in my uniqlo bag where's my uniqlo bag back in melbourne i don't have my id i honestly rely too much on my bank card being in my phone so that's why I just it slipped my mind today. Anyway, he was not gonna let me stay here. I was like, I, I booked it through booking.com. Like my details are in there. I've verified my identity. I've just, I've traveled many times through booking.com. Like I'm a legitimate person. I've got my bank cards. I had other bank cards. I had my Medicare card. I had my bloody health insurance card. I had everything else. I said, I've got photos of my passport and photos of my license. Like you can sit, clearly see that it's the same person. Anyway, I said, I'm honestly gonna be here for 12 hours. I'm checking out at like 7 a.m. tomorrow and it's what, 6.30 p.m. So not gonna do anything, take the bond. I'm not a criminal, I haven't stolen anyone's identity. I had to beg him to let me check in. I mean, good on him for doing his job. I'm really, really proud and he was lovely about it. He was really lovely because I could see that like he didn't want to go against the rules, but I'm just an idiot. <laughs> and I do like this place. It's five minutes from the airport and it'll be five minutes to the Amplify office and it's called the Branksome, Branksome Hotel. And so far it's good. Let's see if the bed is comfy. We good. <laughs> I'm gonna sleep peacefully. I'm really disappointed that I don't get to see my psych. I rescheduled the appointment, by the way, for everyone playing along. It's dinner time. I got fishbowl. I kind of wanted it for lunch tomorrow, but I think I might have like Zeus or something tomorrow instead. <sighs> it was this or Macca's and then I thought, no, I'll save my Macca's for like a Friday night dinner or something. Mm. They didn't give me any napkins either. But it's going down a treat. I do love fishbowl. So yum. Also did a Woolies order. Because <laughs> I definitely don't drink enough water when I travel. And because I want something sweet. I have a tiny bit of work to do. I'm going to do that. And then we're going to have an early night. I'm not doing the AMA tonight. Because I, yeah, I just don't have the mental space to hold space for people right now. Uh, I will do it next week. I just think while I'm traveling and I've got to be up early. Oh my God. That's the right call to make. I just realized the replacement card here is $10. So we definitely can't steal it. <laughs> Skincare done. Time to get into bed. Oh, I've got to turn the rest of the lights in this place off. I'll see you guys nice and early. We do have to wake up and be in the office by like 8, 8.30. So that means... Probably a 6 a.m. Mm. See you then. This is how I woke up, guys. The blinds in here, not very blindy. <laughs> See? <laughs> I don't know if there was like a second blind. <gasps> was there? Yes. Oh. <laughs> let's get in the shower and let's get ready. I'm ready. Here is the fit today. Not loving it, but. I just want to wear something different on the camera for your safe space for like the social clips and I'm going to take my jacket because it doesn't look hot outside like it actually looks like it's going to storm so I can always just like throw that over or something. It doesn't really go with this neckline but I don't really give a shit. I also didn't bring the stuff, the wind in here is so annoying but I didn't bring the stuff to 
curl my hair so it's gonna be straight on the podcast which it's not usually all right let's check out and let's go head to the amplify office look Hello. who's here i'm actually here early are you proud you're here so early <laughs> i was i thought i was like oh i'll come early just in case and you're here <laughs> now i'm gonna go get food we have lots of time thankfully all right i'll be back honestly it's really cold i carried my suitcase up all these stairs and i'm just gonna get like a toasty or like hash brown or something i can't record on an empty stomach otherwise the episodes will be bad <laughs> uh, i regret that it's pouring rain no thank you look who is on my Hi. podcast hi Hello. girls thank you for coming on I'm so grateful. Finally! <laughs> okay, I didn't actually get food before recording with Sal and Al, so I've ordered some hash browns, and then Em and I are gonna jump in to record our podcast together. We're gonna do a date yourself instead podcast, which I'm so keen to do. And yeah, I just needed to eat something before we get into it, because my brain is not working, and I need food. I should have just gone and physically walked to get breakfast this morning. <gasps> Oh my god, it's going to be three minutes away. Let's go down. I am in an Uber going to see Steph. It's quarter past one. I'm really tired. We had our fortnightly meeting and some other stuff. The journal. Beyond the Belly. And some other things next week that I'll tell you about next week. But I'm really tired. Like today, this morning has just been a lot. I'll see Steph and it'll be a nice distraction for her and a nice distraction for Just waiting for Steph to have her x-rays. She's in there right now and I'm just chilling in the hallway. I'm still here for another two hours and I don't mind. It was an experience. And just let the people know you're happy for me to vlog right I'm now. I'm so happy for you to vlog. I actually asked you to vlog. Ordered KFC on Uber Eats and look, Steph's room is beautiful. She's decorated it with lights. Oh wait, wait, we've got something else. All right, wait, 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 here guys. <laughs> this is my light. We love you. <laughs> I love you. The cutest. I love you all. And Adele the most, sorry. You the most. <laughs> what have, have we got? <laughs> some chips that are half filled. We love that. We love that. Thank you, we'll Casey. A review. <laughs> oh my god. We have good. some popcorn chicken. Yes. We have two sliders, ten nuggets. We're like eating this. good today. We are. <laughs> we are eating for mm. all of the missed times that I haven't eaten. Really good. And some potato oh. and gravy. And, and two a, bag chips. Two straight chips. <laughs> Perfect. Amazing. You can't do it with one hand. No. <laughs> okay. I, I'm going to have to get you to film you, me. Yeah, I will film you. Yeah. You taught me how to do this. Yeah. I actually didn't know you could do this. <laughs> okay, ready? I get so nervous. I know. <laughs> yes first wow. time well done thank you thank you it would you. honestly it's the worst part oh my god I'm we love the environment but the paper straws yeah the paper straws. it's very difficult yeah sensory okay. overload i have to do the same energy that yeah. you had oh my god that was louder, that was really louder. <laughs> cheers cheers <laughs> mm. that hits the spot that was so good oh my god i got the black pearls i'm dropping my bag and I'm gonna go check in my flight. There is literally no one in here. I feel like, is the airport closed? No, it's actually open. <laughs> it's only 6 p.m. but where the fuck is everyone? I don't know. I have an hour to kill so I'm gonna do some work. I've gotta do, well, I've gotta get ready the podcast for Thursday and I'm thinking I might take a day tomorrow just for me and try not to do any work so if I can do as much as I need now in preparation for that then I think I'll be smart but thankfully I've got my charger I've got my laptop that I didn't break it that happened and I can connect to the Wi-Fi in here it's actually quite quick thank you Sydney Airport also I had the best time with Steph and she was feeling better and I can't wait till she's out I'm hoping she's out in the next week which is good because I just want her to feel better and I want her to feel like herself again and I want us to do fun things outside of the hospital because she's missing that. We are back in Melbourne. Guys, it's 9.40 and everything is shut in the airport and I wanted a snack. <laughs> that is what? My 
fifth last flight this month. No way. <laughs> I've got four more flights. Yeah, fifth last. <laughs> we have to get snacks. Hey Angel, did you oh, hang on? I come to you. I come to you. We don't have to jump. We don't have to oh we don't have to jump. I love you. I missed you. Hello. I just unpacked and I'm gonna get in the shower now, but my hair has been annoying me all day, right? Because I wanted to curl it, but I didn't bring the stuff to curl my hair today. And I just don't like it straight anymore. I feel like I prefer my hair with a wave. Anyway, I'm looking in the mirror and my hair is giving postpartum. Can you see these? These are like new hairs. I didn't, why, why am I growing another row of hair? Because <sighs> all, all day I've been going like this and I'm like, my hair line is going weird. And it's because of these baby hairs. I thought it was the long... Why am I... Mm. <laughs> Literally had to clip my hair like that. I'm feeling a bit more relaxed after having a hot shower. It's quite hard to unwind after having a late flight. And my brain was going 100 miles an hour pretty much all day until I got to the hospital. And I loved being at the hospital. But again, I just... I hate leaving stuff there. Like... <sighs> Makes me sad, so sad. I've come up with a bit of a plan for tomorrow. I'm gonna work in the morning and then take the afternoon off, but you guys can see that in the other video or in the vlog. <laughs> I've got Mr. Franklin here with me. I'm gonna sleep with him tonight and I'm gonna get some rest because it has been a long day and I'll see you all in the morning. Rats and shine. Oh. Someone's got my cup out and my coffee. That would be mum. Franklin, come here. He's not coming here. <laughs> this is where he is in the patch of sun. The only patch of sun right now. In our house, eat cold, sweetheart. I've just been trying to wake up. <laughs> I've just sat here. Trying to come back to life because I am not going to lie, I'm pretty tired today. I did fall asleep till about 1.30 and I woke up at 7.30 but it's now 8.30 and I'm like I need to get to the gym. So I'm going to chuck on this set. Honestly my motivation to go to the gym is non-existent but I always feel better after I go. So. That's why I keep going. I'm going to quickly eat and then I'm going to walk King Franklin. My sister walked him yesterday and she did his massages. I love her. And Angel. I'm surprised he hasn't come to get any blueberries actually. <laughs> also, I'm going to eat outside because I need to soak up some vitamin D. I will not be putting my hoodie back on. I need, I need you to put your head in here. In the, no. oh, please come back. This way. There we go. Oh my goodness. We got there eventually. We got there. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Oh, thank you for the kisses. You ready? You ready? Oh, oh, all right. Grab it. Let's go. No, grab your lead. Oh my God, I've put the harness on. <laughs> Hang on, buddy. <laughs> All right, we're actually gonna go now. Let's go. I'll just get my tea out of here. <laughs> Grab it. Come on, quickly. Our walk was good, and now we're gonna have a shower. Cause someone's stinky. <laughs> good boy. Mummy, get a kiss. It's not that bad. 
Come here. He hates me. <laughs> He's almost dry, by the way. But I put a towel on his bed and a towel on the concrete because he just rolls around. Otherwise, he'll roll on the grass, and I don't want that. See, look at this. Nice and shiny. Nice and fresh. Good boy. I find it easier to bath him like that where I stay out of the shower rather than getting in it with him. But I just had my own shower and now I'm going to get ready for the day. I'll jump on do like an hour's worth of work and then I'm going to head out on my solo date. I'm excited. I'm ready. I've just kept a casual but cute fit and really basic jewelry just like these little gold earrings. I already feel a little bit better because I've got wavy hair which I know sounds so stupid but I just feel like me when it's like this like much better. I'm back home. I'm just doing some work now. I was originally going to take like a whole day off but I just needed to take the afternoon and it was perfect and I'm really happy that I did that for myself. Right now I'm just replying to emails and things that I did not get done while I was a bit offline. Miss Emily's all over it. Anyway, <laughs> we will have dinner in a second, well maybe in like about half an hour. I bought myself flowers again too, how pretty are they? Having burgers, men's a halloumi one. I'm so hungry. I didn't wash my hair. I'll do it tomorrow. I'm having a tea. I've got my dashi cup. Look at it. And on the inside it says, life is better with a dash end. It's so cute. And it's, I've got a pink tea in here. It's pomegranate from the advent calendar and yes i know it's not december but i don't care i've been drinking one nearly every day i will run out of the advent calendar probably before we even hit december <laughs> oh. anyway i feel like i'm gonna sleep good tonight i did get a massage earlier and i also kind of took the day off uh, instagram and i just reduced a lot of the workload that i would do today and i needed to do that i think because, yeah, I just feel like my emotional capacity is, like, very thin. Like, it's waning at the moment. So, I just need to fill my cup up and make myself feel better. But I'm going to get Mr. Frank and bring him to bed. And then we can say goodnight. He wants my tea. But look, they kind of look the same. It's not him, by the way. This is a random mug. They look the same. <laughs> I love you so much. Good night, Franklin. Sweet dreams, baby. Oh, my gosh. Best sleep of my life. Mm, that was so good. I actually feel rested and ready. <gasps> my tulips, look. This one's floppy. All right, let me try and fix that. We're going to the gym. I'm doing a upper body workout. This will be the set of choice. I've also made the bed, but I'm gonna change the sheets later and like wash my hair and everything else too. Sun is out as well, so beautiful day to get shit done and we have Frank's physio appointment which I'm hoping he's made more progress, hasn't put on weight. I'll take you guys along anyway. That workout was really good and it was upper body which I love. My shoulders are looking we love. Anyway, I'm gonna have a quick brekkie and then we're jumping in the car because someone has a physio. He's gonna come running because I'm gonna get the blueberries. These berries are huge, like giant. <laughs> Very predictable. I, knew, I know you so well. Look at how cute and handsome he looks. All right, buddy. Oh, he's already falling asleep. <laughs> we'll be there soon. We are done at the physio. Franklin had some laser therapy today. We didn't do any exercises because he actually needed to have some of the muscles in his spine released a little bit more deeply than what I can release it manually. So he still obviously will get the massage, but sometimes we need to do extra therapies, which is exactly why we love coming here. He also weighed in at 5.9 kilos. He's lost more weight. And I said to her, should I give him a bit more food to like 
keep him at six, but she's happy with where he is. He's actually lost so much weight that this doesn't fit him anymore. Can you see how big this is? So I'm gonna have to buy him the extra, extra small so that you don't slip out of it because that would terrify me. But we're gonna head home now and I reckon he's gonna sleep so well because he, you could see that he was like, oh, what's going on? He was hyper alert in there. I'm so proud of you. I'm so glad that we are on top of this. Honestly, I would do anything for him. <sighs> oh, let's go home. Treating myself to sushi today. I'm just being basic, but the weather's really nice. I'm gonna sit outside and I just thought, I really want the two tuna rolls, so that's what I got. Mr. Frank slept the whole way. He was so adorable. But yeah, I've been in the car for two hours because it's quite a far way away. And I was like, I'm getting sushi. <laughs> I then need to get stuck into work because, yeah, I feel not as productive when I'm in the car for so long. Mm. So simple, but I love it. Quick little update. It's 4 p.m. In one hour at 5 p.m. I've got my therapy appointment. I rescheduled Mondays because we know what happened on Monday. And... I guess just a little reminder, it's nice to buy yourself flowers, take yourself on a solo date, go get a massage, but also looking after your mental health or looking after yourself includes your mental health. And sometimes that is therapy, seeing a psychologist, a psychiatrist, taking medication, like that's okay too. But aside from looking forward to that, I've just been doing some podcast work, potentially getting a guest on next week. I'm almost done editing up until next week as well, next Thursday, which is huge. And I've been productive this afternoon. I like it. I'm all red because I just went out for a walk while I had my therapy appointment. And it was so good. Oh, I wish I could have seen her on Monday. But tonight is just as good. Today was just as good. And yeah, I got to unpack everything I wanted with her. I actually had a list today because I didn't want to forget anything. I usually go in there and I'm like, oh yeah, everything's fine. But I had things that I definitely wanted to unpack. And kind of told her like what I did yesterday and she's like yeah I'm really proud of you because you need that and that's exactly what I want to tell you like self-care boundaries you already know the drill so it's nice to be on the right path and just have her support and now I feel good I think I'll sleep good again tonight part of me is like kind of can't be bothered making the bed though or washing my hair tonight maybe I'll just do it tomorrow we're having soup tonight guys yum I know people are like, oh my god, it's hot weather, why are you having soup? Because mum had dental work today, so we're having soft, a soft meal. Sorry. Don't apologise. I it's love still this. Liquid, it's still more than it nice. Yum. Look, yum. Because if you know, you know, cheese is a must. Probably a little bit more, actually. Yeah. We also have this from the deli, which we've never tried before, so I'm excited. I don't know how I feel about this one. Costco is the best. Mm. We now have a delivery unboxing for Frank. This is for you, sweet angel. They really sticky taped it. Real good. Franklin, look what I got you. He doesn't even care. <laughs> oh my god, what is it? He doesn't even care. What did mommy get you? This is for you. <gasps> what is it? Wow. Wow. So we can do his walking. I'll show you. It's like pole. It's an agility course oh. for him. We got a ball. Yes, you love the balls. All right, there you go. Can you even... Oh. Also comes with, what's this, a frisbee? Franklin has to do this exercise yes. where he walks over the height and I just don't have this type of equipment on hand. So I did, I bought it from Amazon. I will not let IVDD kill my dog. So Franklin, come here, puppy. Can you walk over? All right, we need some treaties. Here, come to Nana. Do you want some? No, good, good boy. No, see, that's what we don't uh, want. Watch him behave so once we have the tree. <laughs> See how he stepped over? Yes, I've got it too close. So what we want to do is get him just stepping over instead of jumping over. That was a jump. Yeah? He gets excited with the food. Over? Good boy. Good boy. Yay! Good boy. 
Stepping. Good boy. Stepping. We'll get better at it. This is his first time. That's no. <laughs> yeah? Good boy. Yes. That was good. Yeah? Yes. Good boy. We'll get there. I'm an idiot, everybody, because it's not these ones that go in here. It's actually these ones which get put together with this. But it's been a big day for this guy. Oh, you're so cute. Look at how he's sitting on this pillow. You right there? Good night. I will deal with this and this tomorrow. <laughs> I don't have the energy to do it today, so I didn't. And I'm feeling slightly hungover after my therapy appointment, but so is King Franklin, who is in here. We're going to sleep together because why not? He had a big day and he deserves a cuddle. So do I. <laughs> Good night, you guys. Good morning. I ended up pulling the claw clip out at like 3 a.m. Why'd I fall asleep with it? I don't fucking know. But I slept good and I feel better. I really needed therapy last night. So <laughs> we love her. Thank you so much. <laughs> and what am I doing today? It's Friday. We're going to go to the gym. We're going to walk Franklin. And we've got a doctor's appointment. But the rest of the day I'll just be here in front of this computer. So very low key. Not very entertaining, but I feel like that's what I need, so I'm excited, I'm looking forward to it. I've got a busy as fuck weekend, so if we can have a chill Friday, that's good with me. I worked up a bit of a sweat doing that. Let's get ready and go to the gym. I also would probably have a rest day today in a perfect world, but I want to get ahead. So today will be day three of this week, and then I can do day four on Sunday and take a rest tomorrow so that I'm not behind next week, because next week it's probably going to be really challenging for me to get it done, but whatever. I can catch up now, so we're going to. All right, that workout was so sweaty, and the gym was packed. When I mean packed, I mean there were exercises I actually couldn't do because all the things were taken, the machines, the bars, everything. So I had to really scramble my workout just then and do it back to front and do the exercises in the wrong order, but whatever, I got it done. <sighs> I'm starving. On my way into the doctor's surgery, I do need to find a new GP. It's just in the too hard bucket right now. So that's a future adult issue doctor's visit was a success. I booked it because I needed to get a new script for my pill because I had ran out and I finished my period and I haven't taken any of my pills. So maybe that could be the reason why I'm feeling a little bit woo woo <laughs> at the moment. But my psych yesterday also recommended a blood test to check my iron because I had been explaining to her just how I've been feeling and kind of the symptoms I've got at the moment. And she's like, this is very similar to how you felt right before you had your last infusion. She's like, yes, you've got a lot on your plate. She's like, but the fatigue, everything feeling really hard, really exhausting, feeling really tired, being like struggling to get out of bed. She's like, let's just check the iron. So I ended up getting a blood test, which you don't have to fast for or anything like that. And I will see what the situation is. Cause the last time I checked my iron was in, I'm gonna say Feb, potentially Feb, March. It was around my birthday. That's the last blood test I had and it was good. But I also had my infusion this time last year, the last one. So I had two infusions so far. And this could maybe be a reason why. We'll find out. I need to know how this is possible. I express posted this yesterday at 2 p.m. It's now quarter past 12. His new harness. What? And I got the purple one because it's really cute. I'm obsessed. Can't wait to put this on him. I'm gonna walk him later because it was too hot to walk him today after I got back from the gym. I think I'll do it as the sun is like going down once the main part of the heat of the day is out because I don't want to overheat him. We did a try on haul, looking very handsome in the purple. And now he wants a WAOK. -okay. It's quite warm. So I'm just honestly taking him up the street and then we'll come back inside because <laughs> he's very keen. All right, come on. Grab your lead, please. Yes, good boy. Come on. It was way too hot for a walk. 
I ended up just walking to the pharmacy so that I could go and pick up these. Thankfully, I'm going to start taking it later. How are you feeling? As soon as I put it on, he wanted to go, but I just had to show him that it was way too hot for that because he didn't really want to walk once we got outside. Anyway, I've just been watching the vlog and I've started cooking my lunch. I am... Oh, oh she's so cute. I love you, Sam. Just making my life so easy. Anyway, let me show you what I'm having for lunch. I'm proud of myself because I'm not ordering Uber Eats. I'm making a slider with halloumi in it because I really enjoy the KFC sliders and I'm really loving halloumi. So I'm like, why don't I just make it myself? And I think it's going to come out yummy. I mean, we'll find out. This is my first time trying it. If it's good, I will make like a TikTok or a reel about it. Tell me that doesn't look good. I put caramelized onion spread on the bottom, mixed lettuce, tomato, halloumi, and barbecue sauce, and 10 out of 10. I think I love it. Mm-hmm. The only thing I'm unsure about is the bread. It's these ones. They're a bit too thick and chewy. I mean, they're okay, they're passable. I'll finish the pack. I need to try something thinner. what we're having pizza and we got a seafood one and a meat one and that's lasagna you should not be sitting there buddy okay guys i went to try and go for a walk and i found these baby baby birds they're tiny and we're gonna go take them to the wildlife rescue because we couldn't find the nest. Oh my God, cover them, cover them. We couldn't find the nest or the parents. And now I've roped mum into this with me. Mm -hmm. This is really cute though. She said that we could try and put the makeshift nest. We've got them in an ice cream container up in the tree, but it's, we can't find the nest. So this is our next best option. I'm home. I can't believe that happened. Wild Friday night rescuing the wildlife. <laughs> They're gonna be looked after and then released back where we found them. So good news story, guys. Anyway, it's time to sort this out. I'm not feeling very hot at the moment. I'm going to say I'll see you in the morning. I will quickly show you where little Franklin is. He's curled up in his crate. Sweet dreams, Angel. Love you. Good morning. <gasps> A single ear fit. <laughs> Good morning. Got my coffee. It's 7.30. We actually have a busy day today. I'm just trying to figure out the most efficient way to get things done. The hay fever is also really scratchy. <laughs> or itchy. How did you sleep, mister? Oh, he's so cute. <gasps> I nearly spilled this. So this morning I got invited to the Kiki K Chadston store opening, so that's what we're gonna go do first. I also need to go to the PO box because I should have gone yesterday and I didn't. And then I've got a friend's 30th, so this makeup is gonna carry me through all day, hopefully. New outfit unlocked. I've never worn this and this together, but I think I like it. I've also got these on. And I might take like my denim jacket as a throw, but it's a bit muggy, so I think I'll be all right. Quick breaky. I'm in line at the PO box now. I'm running good for time. Done by 9.06, we have the giveaway boxes I needed to grab. And we also have a pair of shoes, which I'll show you later. We're at Chadston and the emergency alarm is going off. Surely not. Mum has come with me and I have been given instructions that I... <laughs> okay, hang on. The content was filmed successfully. The alarm stopped going off. <laughs> we were safe to enter. We were fine. And I met the creative director of Kiki K and her daughter and they were really lovely. They, they were. were so sweet. We bought some things. We'll show you when we get home. And mum's driving my car because I have to edit the content and get it up before 12 o'clock. I got the content up. I'm so happy with how it came out. They didn't even ask me to send it to them to approve it because usually they do. They more or less said it has to go up by 12. 
here's the guidelines. It was very clear, it was very easy to follow, and I loved working with them. It's my first time working with them as well, which, yeah, the fact that they just trusted me, I was like, this is nice. It's a good feeling. Anyway, I've roped mum into getting my petrol because <laughs> my light just went off, and she's like, yeah, I'll do it. I was like, very quick Kiki K haul. This is for mum. It's a black bag. It's her new work bag. Do you love it? I do love it. Thank you. I bought this for her because that was her payment for coming with me and taking my content. We bought home our little cup holders, little stubby holders. Oh, wait. I also went into JJ's very quickly and I bought... I love drama because I'm going to wear it when I record the Thursday episodes of the podcast. And this Care Bear tee, how cute is it? It says mood. I can wear this when I'm PMSing. And then we also got from Kiki K a birthday card for Liana because it's her 30th. I'm going to write this and go there right now. And then mum got a passport holder. How cute. Wrong way. And what's this? Like a it's little my card holder because I've just got loose in my bag at the moment. You have them loose in the bag? Yeah. Put it on, give us a little haul, come here. Oh. Put it on your shoulder. Awesome. Cute. Awesome. Yeah, it'll fit everything in there, my lunch, come my laptop. Way. Turn around, give us a side view, beautiful. She's got a strap as well. Mm. Hi Frank, we're Thank back you. baby. Beautiful. You're welcome. Okay, I'm at Liana's 30th, I'm going to head in. I've got her present and her card in here. I'm going to leave you guys just because I, yeah, I'm going to be by myself. I don't really know that many people there and I'm already on edge a little bit. So I'm hoping that it will be fine. I'm just like having a bit of social anxiety. Anyway, I'll see you when I'm done and it'll be so fine. The party is done. I am heading home at what, 7 p.m. I got here just before one and it was so fine. I was panicked. And I shouldn't have been because her friends and family are amazing. All my mascara has smudged. Can you see that? Oh, no, 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 no. That's bad because it's like didn't last the day. And it wasn't even that hot. Like it was a tiny bit muggy in there. That's not good. That's the Maybelline one. I think I need to find a new mascara because I cannot be having that when it gets warm. Anyway, it was a really good night. Liana had a good time. And I'm going to get food on the way home because... I'm trying not to spend too much on Uber Eats. I made a TikTok during the week that just called out my Uber Eats spending and I was like, wow, I really need to get on top of it. So I'm going to try and start getting on top of it. I'm in Coles because I realized if I drive to go get food, that's probably not helping me save or stop spending my money. Like it's the same as getting Uber Eats, just not paying the delivery. I want the really mini ones. Is that what ones I want? Street tacos, maybe these? Yeah, okay. Hello, I missed you. Can you smell me? I know, I was holding all the babies. I smell like little kitties. <laughs> See how these are thinner? Much better. I think these will be a hit. Yum. Much better. I just did the biggest, like, deepest you want. <laughs> Wow, I'm so tired. I got the podcast up for tomorrow and scheduled the YouTube video that comes out tomorrow. It was all ready. I just had to like put it into the back end stuff so it actually gets published. And then I just sat on my computer and I looked at the time. It's like 11.30. Why? Oh, I'm cold too. I text the bird lady today. <laughs> I was like, I'm so sorry to be annoying, but I just want to know how the birds are. And she's like, they're good. They just ate. And she gave me an update. Honestly, they're my Roman Empire at the moment. They were so cute. I kind of want to message her again and be like, when you release them, can you call me? Because like, I'll come out and I'll meet you where I found them. <laughs> we'll release them together. Anyway, I'm tired. I'm also like a low key losing my voice. So I think I need to zip it and just go to sleep. Good night. <laughs> better because I've got a coffee my eyes were like struggling to open before <laughs> I'm tired but we're going to the gym because it's day four of the program and we're finishing it before the end of the week we love after my workout I'm basically 
I'm gonna come home, get ready, and then head off to another event. This is like a PR event. I got invited by Novo Shoes, and I'll show you the shoes. They're the ones I got yesterday. But I'm really excited because I like Novo Shoes, and they've had events before, but I hadn't been invited, and this is my first time getting invited, so I said yes. But that's what we'll be doing today, and I can't wait, and I'm gonna take you guys along. But first, we need to go and smash a workout. Gym. I did go past One Night Stand Boutique because I needed to get an outfit that went with these shoes for the event. These are the shoes that Novo gifted me. Nice little kitten heel with a strap. It's like a two strap back. And let me show you what dress I got. It's really cute. I'm so happy. Just letting you all know, I will be learning how to make acai because I really wanted it. Like, really badly. This is a close second. I did a tiny little brown winged liner because my makeup always looks the same and I just thought, change it up a little bit, Adele, live a little. I'm ready. Do you guys like this? I think it looks cute. It's not showing up the best on the camera. But this bag and let me just show you shoes cute 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 we have to head off because i'm running late i think this is the best way that i could style them i am finished with the event they gave us a very pretty white rose with a little <laughs> Novo bow. It was good, it was nice to see some friends. And I was going to go and have like lunch at Chin Chin because I parked right near here. And then I was like, no, just go home, start unwinding because it's been a big, it's been a big social weekend and I honestly just need to like recharge my battery a little bit. <laughs> but it was fun, I'm glad I went. I just ate a muesli bar. I haven't eaten since breakfast, I'm hungry. Dinner's nearly ready, but I feel like I'm wasting this outfit and this hair and makeup part of me is like let's just go out no Adele get it together bitch no <laughs> we need to get out of the dress put on something comfy and start to unwind because mm. <laughs> I took the cute dress off I'm just wearing this loungewear set I wasn't ready to put on pajamas and I gotta have a shower and wash my face again Oh, I should take the earrings out because I kind of look... No, I'm leaving them in. I want to look cute. We're having pasta tonight. Look, we have meatballs. <laughs> Thanks, Mum. You're welcome, honey. I'm now making a tea. It's the creme brulee one. Yum. I'm going to put a dash of milk in there as well. Okay, this is goals, guys, because Toblerone, like, as in the Toblerone, gifted me their new pralines. They sent me two packets, and they're so yummy. They come like this. They're like a new Christmas. They're so cute. Carla's trying one. I already ate two. Mm. I don't even want another one. I'm full. It's nice, isn't it? Mm. Yeah. Also, my tea absolutely slaps. Say goodnight, everybody. I'm going to bed now. Good night, weekly vlog. Kiss from Frank. And just like that, we are at the end of the weekly vlog. Frank is in his crate. I'm about to get into bed. I've got a little pimple down here with my pimple patch coming along <laughs> but I am feeling actual ready for bed because <laughs> it's been a busy weekend and it's been a big week and everything still feels exhausting everything still feels fucked and <laughs> quite frankly I'm hoping it's my iron really badly but I guess we'll see and on that note just thank you for supporting me always but especially when I'm going through it and just and when my mind is not being the nicest, it does go a long way when you guys are extra sweet to me or leave me a nice comment or leave me a beautiful message to read. And I just am so grateful always. I need to tell you that truly from the bottom of my heart. I will never, ever take you guys for granted, especially my YouTube family, because you guys are the best. You guys are real ones. You sit here and watch an hour long vlog. <laughs> anyway, I love you. Please look after yourselves. Oh, 
One bit of housekeeping before I go. The YouTube giveaway winner from last week has not emailed me their address. So I haven't posted that prize. Well, I haven't posted either of them. They're going to be posted hopefully tomorrow if I can get your address. So a little reminder to anyone who entered, check your emails. I would have replied to your comment from that blog. The giveaway is now closed, so don't go and comment on it. But I really want to give that person their prize. So please, please, please check and make sure you claim it. All right. I will see you guys next week. Be safe, look after each other, look after yourselves and do something nice for yourself. It goes without saying, but maybe because I'm going through it, like these times when things are tough or when you're having a really dark week, little pockets of joy in the day will make it better and will help you get through it. Okay, so that's what I'm going to do and that's what I want you to do. And if you've had a good week, I'm glad. I'm glad you're having a good week for the rest of us who aren't. I love you guys. I'll see you soon. Bye.